This is Vision Pro, the future of technology, the future of humanity. In this video, we want to talk about Vision Pro, a headset that combines the real world with a digital world. The same thing we have seen in all science fiction movies. The user moves a series of digital menus with his hand, enters a screen. Everything is in a world that is not real, but at the same time, the real world is there. I will be happy if you accompany me until the end of the video because your brain is going to explode and I will be happy if you subscribe to Mobile Forget. Yo, lovely mobile guys, welcome to Mobile Focus. The desire to connect the real world to the digital world is not a new thing, and many companies have been working on this for several years. Perhaps the best example of this is Microsoft's HoloLens 2, a device that does exactly the same thing, but Apple advertises much more attractively and it's much stronger in marketing and because Apple is much richer, everyone says the Vision Pro is a revolutionary product. If it is, yes, it really is, but it is not the only product that is like this. Previously, we had a Google Lens, which never reached the final product. Another company that works very well with Apple is Meta, the former Facebook. Zuckerberg tried to take humanity to a new world by creating the VR world and the Metaverse world. But VR is not enough for today's people. Apple created Mixed Reality, with a more advanced move AR, VR in combination with the real world. Let's leave the history aside and find out what is the point of this product and why companies should make such a product. The main issue is that when something becomes widespread in the world, companies should go for something more specific. I will give you some examples. When humans were able to build cars, it was only for special people. And when it became widespread, men went for something newer. Humanity created the airplane. When the airplane reached the point where people achieved to their private jet, mankind started building spacecraft. And private space agencies were created, SpaceX, Blue Origins, and many other examples. When the Unreal Engine 5 graphics engine becomes free, then the game companies have to go to the Nuri world. Then I have a camera in my studio that is used in the cinema industry and Hollywood. The film companies should go to the Nuri world. When the mobile phone gives you everything you want, then we have to go for something new. And these newer things have also achieved this, which is mixed reality where by using artificial intelligence and using Web3, the use of decentralized space with the use of hardware facilities will create an interactive space for you. Today, if you saw a movie, it would be in a 3D image. When you were playing video games, it was only on a 3D screen and your only communication method was a mouse and a keyboard. What if I tell you that from now on, you will be in the heart of the game itself? This is what humanity needs. Interaction. It's overlooking at a screen that doesn't give you any feedback. You can now go to the heart of the content that you are looking at somewhere right now. That's what makes this product revolutionary. As I said at the beginning of the video, subscribe and don't forget to like this video. We will dedicate the rest of the video to what Vision Pro can do. Ladies and gentlemen, I invite you to a new era of spatial processing. When you put Vision Pro on your head, you are in the real world, but all the applications you need and love are in the real world around you, so that even their shadows fall on the objects around you. The name of this operation system is Vision OS. 
Apple's first space operation system. What is meant by space? That is, everything is suspended in space. So it's between applications by changing the angle of your eyes. What the f... With this movement, you can select app. With this gesture, you can scroll. And with your words, whatever you want to type. It is something like magic. Applications have dimensions and reacting to the light, and as I said before, they have shadows. Shadows. The important thing is that it doesn't cut you off from the real world. When someone is in the room, you see him, and he sees your eyes. Which improves if what is not to separate you from the real world. When you play photos and videos, everything gets dark so that you can focus on the photos and video. Vision Pro also has a 3D camera, and you can record your movement with this camera and see them in 3D. In such an environment, the use of applications becomes more different. Imagine going inside the application. For example, Apple Mindful, which helps you to relax, he drowns you in himself. Now you want to watch a movie with something like this. It makes the surroundings dark for you. You can enlarge and reduce the dimensions as much as you want. And it will create epic dimensions for you, as you want. And your screen can be any size. And a sound that is played for you is spatial sound. Like the image that is suspended in the space, the sound is also in the space. You can completely hear the sound in three dimensions around you and in interaction with objects. How to play games? Pick up the game controller, play the game, and you can guess the rest yourself. Now let's go to the workspace. This is something that should be priority, because people want to make money with it. The main difference between this device and the devices you have seen so far is that the images inside are very sharp. Of course, according to the Apple itself, you can use Vision Pro anywhere and have your specific workspace. For example, you can work with editing software and uh, check your social media in another side and then go to another room and with a specific workspace play your favorite movie. You may shake your hands a lot and it will try you for a long time, but this problem will be solved in future versions of Vision Pro. How is the video communication in this device? With the camera on it, it first scans your face. The angle of your eyes is checked and when you activate FaceTime, the 3D face is created off you, which of course is not real and will improve over time. But the important thing is that with the spatial audio feature, when you use the person you are speaking in front of you, can hear his voice completely from the front. And when you move your head to the left to see, for example, a browser, you hear his voice from your right ear. Now you want to work with your MacBook. The dimensions of 13 or 15 inches can be converted into any dimensions you want. But that's not all. Another working day ends. You are tired, you are stressed, and you want to go to another space. You put Vision Pro on your head and boom. You enter an immersive space that is very attractive. Whether you are at home or on a plane, you are immersed in the digital world. A digital world that resembles reality. This was the simple definition of Vision Pro. But why was it so long? Because everything is new. The device itself means a lot of development. It is going to be sold at the beginning of next year at a price of $3,500. The price is very reasonable for all these new technologies. It may have some strange flaws in the design. For example, how it can cool itself and the high heat it generates causes sweat around our eyes. MacBook Air is this size and has no fan and it gets hot. And Vision Pro is this size 
and has no fan and has the same chipset, so how can it cool itself? The battery is separated from the device to make it lighter. And the wire that is connected to you can be a weakness in the design. This wire can get stuck in many places, or you don't like to put the battery in your pocket, and a thousand other stories. We have to be patient because this is just the beginning of this story. This is Momo Focus, and it was my honor to make this video for you. If you like it, please let me know what you think. This is much more information from Apple's WWDC 2023 that I will upload all for you. I respect you and as always, just focus on yourself.